Hello, hello and welcome to Off The Wire. I'm your host, S. Molly Dominic. The S stands for Season's Greetings. Who's ready for Thanksgiving? You, is it you? I am. Thanksgiving is a very special time of year for me. It's a time when I welcome morbid obesity, shoving thousands of calories into my face like a freshman on the 14 meal plan. Wait, I always do that. It's a time when I sit across the table from my granny and she whispers everything because of her hearing aids and I can't understand a thing she says. And I smile and nod and ask my mom to recap everything she said after she's left the house. Wait, I always do that. Let me try that again. Guys, you can relate to this, can't you? Thanksgiving is the day when you wipe the dust from the dining room table because it's the only day you use the dining room table. <laughs> it's the day when your two vegan aunts come over to eat a small container of tofurkey in silence. And your grandma has dentures, so she mostly just like slurps the gravy. And uh, you eat an entire turkey by yourself. Oh, wait, I guess that's just my family's Thanksgiving. <clears throat> well, uh, I've always wanted a Thanksgiving dinner like the ones I see on TV. I guess that will only be in my dreams. Just like being a star on TV will also only be in my dreams. Nice segue, thanks self. No, I'm not talking about my lackluster hosting job. I'm talking about America's Got Talent. With zero plan and zero talent, the Off The Wire crew drove to Orlando to go audition. Here's what happened. Where are we going? America's, America's got, got talent. talent. Do we have an act? Uh, no. I don't think so. No. no. We, uh, no. We we're about like 10 miles out from a place called Yeehaw Junction. So I'm not really sure where that is, but I'm expecting to find like a whole bunch of kind of rednecks just grilling up roadkill and just having a good time. Did you guys just audition for a... Uh, Yes, we did. What did yeah. you, you guys do? I'm just curious. We sang. Can we, can we do like an interview with you about it? Sure. Yeah. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. How long have you been doing comedy? I told my first joke when I was like eight. I told it to my family. It's corny. It's real corny. But it's how we went. It was like, what did the cowboy say to the farmer? Yeehaw! It was so corny. I hated it. But everybody in my family laughed. <laughs> So we are at the Orange County Convention Center. We had three and a half hours of car ride to come up with an act, and we still don't have an act. Luckily, I'm not in this alone. I've got my friends here helping me out. I don't know what we're gonna do. in line. I'm really nervous. I signed up for this in May and this is my time to shine. I, I guess I'm gonna sing a song in a really high voice like hey, hey, like a chipmunk or something. <sighs> I'm super nervous. It sounds like it's really going really well in there. It sounds like a... <laughs> I'm finna get some girls. I'm finna get some girls. It sounds like it went well. It really did and I hope it goes well for you too. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Please wish me luck. I got you. I just did right now. Bless you. <laughs> My amiga. My amigo. Sounds like it's going really well in there. Oh, hey Molly, how'd it go? <laughs> I think we should all just like be used to that already. <laughs> Shouldn't we? Shouldn't we just accept that we all suck? Yay, we're so talented. Uh, so based off of that, you can tell we're gonna have a great show for you tonight with our, 
we can take a jab at ourselves. <laughs> it's fine. But we are, but truly, we're going to have a great show for you tonight. And we are so excited to introduce to you our special guest, Emmy Award winning sound editor Jeffrey Stern. So stay tuned, live audience. We'll be right back with more Off the Wire. Woo! 